Right, this is going to be a VR to Robin of Toadstool Tarot, who's created a three card selfie tag where you determine a significator for yourself within the deck, um, and then you flip through the deck until you get your significator and you pull the card before it and the card after it. And in the sense of a selfie, um, you can look at a specific aspect or a specific question, or you can just take a snapshot of what's going on in your life right now, where you are, what you're doing, how you're doing. Um, and that's the way I'm going to go for it. Um, um, there's a number of, of cards I might consider as a significator, but generally I tend to see myself, <laughs> for better or for worse, as the, the Queen of Swords, which is not my zodiac sign. Um, my, my sun sign is Scorpio, but Libra is my rising sign, so I, and it, it describes me pretty well. Sorry, I'm just picking a, a crumb off the, off the mat here, because <laughs> Queen of Swords. <laughs> Anyway, without further ado, I'm just going to give it another quick shuffle. I hope I'm sort of staying in camera here. I can't really see what I'm doing. Oh, okay. We're on the move, apparently. All right. Better shift. All right. And we'll give it a go. So here we go. And, of course, in typical fashion, my nose is suddenly starting to itch. Excuse me. Open nose. So turn the deck over. Find the Queen of Swords. Queen of Pentacles. Ace of Wands, and as Robin said, it's probably going to be right down at the bottom of the deck because that's always the way it is, isn't it? Come here, you. Uh, what's that one that's hiding there? No, it isn't. Okay. All right, let's put these aside so I don't have quite so many cards to handle. And of course, um, we'll see how it goes anyway. I'm not very good at reading on the fly. Um, oh, there we are. There we are. Okay, so that would have been this way. Those three cards. I'll put the rest aside. <laughs> so, there we go. Okay. Waiting on things to happen. Well, isn't that true? It certainly is in lockdown Britain at the moment. Um, you know, for a lot of people, certainly for, for myself, I've hardly left the house in the past six months. Um, right. Sorry. I'm back. I got interrupted there. So, where were we? Okay. Uh... Right, so reassessing my options, which of course, again, is a big, because, because life has just not gone anything like was anticipated this year. I'm really just stuck reassessing my options. I'm not able to find a job at the moment, um, having to rethink my future plans, all this kind of thing. Yeah, that, that makes perfect sense. And temperance just, you know, is, is finding that balance, that balance between living a normal-ish, healthy life, um, staying safe. I have, to, I have to keep myself safe for my husband's sake because he's, he's somewhat vulnerable. Um, yeah, it's just really taking a step back, reassessing everything, and finding um, a balance that works for me. Um, God, it's all about bloody lockdown this year, isn't it? But, I mean, that is my life at the moment. I have no other life, let's face it. So, so yeah, so this is what I'm doing. And I think I'm being reasonably successful in my endeavors. I'm not, I'm not concerned about it. I'm, you know, just taking, taking things as they come, being as pragmatic and, you know, positive as, as can be. So, yeah, as a snapshot, that's probably actually pretty accurate. <laughs> okay, that's kind of cool. Well, I hope some other people do this. I see that there's three videos up there already. Um, uh, Kenneth of Common Hawthorne has done it. There was one other one, and I'm sorry, I can't remember. can't remember who did that one. Um, so yeah, I hope to see a few more of these. Maybe even on Instagram. This is the sort of thing that, that lends itself to Instagram as well. Okay, that's it. Go do it. Uh, I hope you're all staying well and safe and healthy and happy, and uh, see you on the other side. Bye.